It was finished years late at a cost far higher than planned. But NASA's James Webb Space Telescope, due for launch next week, may usher in a new era in astronomy. As it gathers information on the universe's earlier stages, star formation and whether planets beyond our solar system may be suitable for life. Its mission goals include searching for the first galaxy or luminous objects formed after the Big Bang and learning how galaxies evolved from their initial birth to the present day. Scientists plan to use the telescope to learn about all phases of the universe's history dating back to just after the Big Bang event, about 13.8 billion years ago, while also studying exoplanets, planets beyond our solar system, as well as worlds closer to home such as our planetary neighbors Mars and Saturn's moon Titan. Finding an Earth-like planet would be amazing. <laughs> I mean, we only know of one planet for sure where life exists and that's Earth. But, you know, that's again the whole reason we launched telescopes like Webb is that we know that planets of all sizes are out there and we want to find ones that have similar temperatures and sizes as Earth to see if they could possibly be anything like Earth. The orbiting infrared observatory designed to be about 100 times more sensitive than its Hubble Space Telescope predecessor is due to blast off on 26 December on an Ariane 5 rocket from a site in French Guiana on South America's northeastern coast. The telescope, boasting four scientific instruments, was developed at a cost of $8.8 billion, with operational expenses projected to bring its total price tag to about $9.66 billion. The U.S. Government Accountability Office said the price has nearly doubled since NASA established a cost baseline in 2009, after earlier cost overruns. NASA has hoped to launch it in 2011, but the date was repeatedly delayed. All the mirrors, um, there's two wings that unfold to help the Webb telescope serve as one big mirror. But even among those wings, there's 18 individual mirrors that come together to look like and act like a single mirror. Telescope arrived in French Guiana in October after a 16-day sea journey from California through the Panama Canal to Port de Periacabo on the Coro River. After launch, it will deploy on a month-long million mile to journey a more distant orbit than Hubble beyond the moon. Always the unexpected discoveries that really excite us the most, you know, when we look at a blank part of sky and see distant galaxies that we didn't realize were there before. Or we look at the atmosphere of an exoplanet and we discover a molecule that we didn't appreciate would be there before and we have to figure out, okay, what does that mean now? and what does that mean for our understanding of how the universe works. So it's often those unknown discoveries that excite me most, and I think we have no doubt that Webb will be providing those um, in abundance. Webb can peer into the clouds of gas and dust where stars are being born. Until now, the dust is those clouds obscured the view.